Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, as you can tell, this is obviously going to be another IMATS haul and let me just say I cannot believe it has been one whole year since I did my first video, since my first video was my IMATS haul from last year. It blows my mind, what did this past year go? I don't know, but here we are. So yeah, let me just tell you a little bit about my experience. It was super fun, if you guys haven't gone, um, it's a bunch of booths in there, and pretty much what you get to do is just shop, 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 shop. It can be dangerous, let me tell you. But yeah, you also get to meet a lot of cool people because they're into makeup just as much as you are, and you get to meet some YouTubers, not a lot, but you do get to meet some like this year, I met Jeffree Star. I don't know if you guys follow me on my Instagram, but if you do, you guys saw I posted a picture of me and him together. I also met Jenny69. I Unfortunately, I didn't get to take a picture with her, but I did meet her and her sister, Annette, who also does makeup. She's just as beautiful in person as she is on her pictures. But yeah, her and then Anna from Dose of Colors. I don't know, and other people. Can't remember right now, but I did get to meet some. And like I said, there's other people who love makeup just as much as you do, so it's like super cool. You connect with everybody pretty much, but I mean, do we really need a reason other than shopping for makeup to do it? But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and get started just because I don't want to make this too long. And yeah, I'm just going to show you guys pretty much what I bought there at the different booths there was, so let me go ahead and get started. So I'll start with this bag right here. This is from Friends Beauty. And there, I just pretty much picked up a bunch of, like, single lashes. A lot of, like, these wispy ones here. Um, I do do makeup, as I stated in my first video. But I do it more now. Um, so, yeah, I really like these for my clients. So, I picked up a good amount of those. I think I picked up, like, 16 pairs. And then I also picked up the RCMA powder. I'm sure you guys have heard of this before. And I hadn't had a chance to try it yet. So, I decided right there. I was like, hey, why not? there so I got it um so yeah I have yet to try it but yeah I picked that up so that's what I got at Friends Beauty and then I did not buy too many stuff because if you guys follow me on Snapchat you guys see I finally got a vanity and um yeah I got that so I didn't really spend too much at IMAX you know because so going to school a girl's gotta save her money yeah let me continue Okay, so then I also went to Dose of Colors, and then I was expecting, like, a cute bag from there because I got a cute one last year, too. Um, I don't know. You can use these, too, because they're made out of, like, cloth material. I don't know. They're super cute, though. So there I picked up their Pro Lash Story. Um, it's pretty much to save lashes in here. Like I said, this is a Pro Edition, so it holds up to 20 pairs, I believe. Let me show you guys. It's a super cute pink color. And then, I don't know if you guys know, but if you don't, pink is my absolute favorite color. Typical girl. But anyways, yeah, that's what it is. It comes with uh, some stickers on there so you can decorate how you want it. And then, yeah, pretty much you just put your pairs of lashes in here to save them. I already have a pair in here. Queen Bees, if you don't you know, those are my favorite freaking lashes ever. So yeah, this is good to have because... Before I was storing them in a little container that only stored like three pairs, I think. That shit was not enough, girl. My eyelashes were in the bathroom, on the windows, on my pillows. They were everywhere, so I knew I had to get a bigger one. Okay, and then from there, I also picked up two pairs of lashes. I got their Iconics, um, but these are the Iconic Lights. I do really love the regular Iconics, but at times I do feel like the band is a little thick for me. And the lights still look super cute, but the band is a little bit thinner, so I feel like these are a little more wearable for me for like every day. Not every day, but you know, when I do wear makeup, I feel like they'd be more comfortable. And I also picked up their lashes in Spellbound. I think these are a pair of their newer lashes. I'm not sure. They reminded me a lot of Queen Bees from Coco Lashes. They're like really wispy and feathery. So I was like, you know what? Let me get them. I'll try them. I haven't tried them before though. Then I picked up their lash adhesive in the dark color and light color. Because like I said, I do do makeup. So I always like to keep both colors in my kit. And this is by far my favorite lash glue. It is a little tough to take off. But those puppies stay on all day. So I can't complain. Then I picked up their minis. I just really like their minis because they're like, let me show you guys. They're really little, so I always carry glue with me when I 
go out anywhere, especially like to concerts and stuff, because you know sometimes they might uh stick off a little bit from the inner corner. They're really small, so this is good. Like I can carry it in my purse whenever I need to like pop that puppy puppy back onto my eye. They're super like small, so you can carry them everywhere. Okay, and then the next thing I bought was some clothing. I didn't, wasn't expecting to buy clothing, but I went and it was just super cute. I couldn't say no. And I kind of said that time. Like, literally, I went with a budget and I think I went over it by like double. And like I said, I didn't buy much, but you know, still. So, pretty much, I got this plaid shirt. I don't know, it's really big on here, but in the back it says Slay. And I thought it was super cute. I'm really into plaid. And then also it's pretty long. So I figured I can use this like as those t-shirt type of dresses. With some cute booties. You know. You know. I can't say no. And then the next thing I bought was this t-shirt. And I swear once I saw this like. I was like girl give me that right now. Like I knew I had to buy this. This is the best t-shirt I think I've ever owned in my life. But anyways let me show you guys. Come on. Don't let anyone with bad eyebrows tell you shit about life. Preach. Come on, you guys would have gotten this shit too. Self explanatory. I needed it. Okay, so next thing I got was some glitters by Eye Candy. I tried these last year also um, when I went to IMAX um, my first time. And they were really good. I really, really like them. So pretty much I got six of them it came like in a little bundle you get a free like i think it's called like sh liquid sugar or something it's pretty much like a glitter adhesive um i bought i guess can't really see them so i'm not even gonna bother like really showing them on there but i got ballistic berry which is like a charcoal gray glitter um jawbreaker which is a silver glitter uh candy coin which is like a light gold glitter can't go wrong with gold girls. Then spearmint, which is a really nice teal glitter, which I didn't have any, so I was like, okay. And then I also got twizzle stick, which is also like a teal, but that has like an iridescent sparkle to it. I don't know, I'll do makeup looks on it later on, you guys will see. And I got raspberry blast, which is like a raspberry color. <laughs> Super cute. So yeah, I picked up that too. And then let's see. So I was at Mamie's, nine, yeah, Mamie's, <laughs> and I picked up these lashes by Flutter Lashes and Intoxicating. Look how bomb those babies look. I haven't tried Flutter Lashes, but I've heard a lot of good things about them, so I was like, hey, why not? And they were on good sell, so I couldn't say no. And I also picked up the Slayla Lashes by Makeup by Shayla. Makeup by Shayla. Sorry, I can't talk right now. I don't know what's wrong with me. But yeah, I really like makeup by Shayla. I don't know if you guys follow her, but if you don't, you should. She's really good. And she's like funny. I don't know. I like her. So I picked up her lashes. And then I also picked up two liquid lips by Girlactic. I haven't tried her lipsticks yet, but they look really good. And I swatched them on my hand, and I swear they lasted all day. And of course, I always go for nudes. So I picked up... Divine. This is more actually not a nude. It's more like of a mauve color, which I also tend to go for a lot. Um, let me see what I can open it. This baby right here. Let me go ahead and try swatching it for you guys. Look at that. Super pretty. It kind of reminds me of like androgyny Lolita type of vibe, you know? I can't say no to those. I own both. And then I also got Posh. And this one reminds me a lot of Ashton by Anastasia and Leo by Jeffrey. Um, it just seems a little lighter to me, but I'm really into like those brownie nudes too. This one is right on bottom. Super pretty. I think this one was my fave of the bowl for sure. And don't mind my stained hands, they're always stained. Okay, and then when I was leaving, I swear that's all I was going to buy. This girl comes up to me, she's like, do you want to buy a beauty blender package? And I was like, no, I'm good. She's like, no, but it's a super good deal. I can't pass a good deal. But, um, yeah, I guess it wasn't bad. It was 35 and it came 
with two beauty blenders, pink, black, micro, and a mini, and then a beauty blender cleaner. So I couldn't pass that up, especially since like for my clients, I always have to have beauty blenders. Then I always have my own personal one too. You know, I don't like to mix them. So I was like, hey, that works. I'll take it. So that's what I bought there. And then at Tar, I only bought one thing. I bought the clay paint liner back to me doing makeup on people this is all i use on my clients i fucking love it it's so dark so pigmented easy to apply it's just so bomb girls so bomb so i had to pick this up just you know restock for my kit and it comes with its own little brush too so you don't have to invest in a brush you get both in one next we have that i only bought one thing as well if you guys fall many anyway he's always raving about this glitter called um reflex pearl and i've been trying to get it online for a while now but every single time i try to buy it i feel like they never have it so when i went i asked them if they have it if they had it and they did so i picked it up it's like a really nice white glitter i'm wearing it on my eyes now I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's really nice because usually when I buy white glitters, they have like a green iridescence to them and I don't like that. Like I just feel like I have to wear green. I don't know. I just don't like the reflex of it. So when I saw this one, it was like I said, Maddie wears it all the time. So I was like, hey, why not? And I tried it and it's so fucking beautiful for sure. I know this is going to be one of my faves. Do you guys hear this okay right now? Okay, it's an old ass song, and I don't know if it's just me, but every time I hear this song, I'm like, that's awesome. Yeah, that song makes me feel like super sassy, I'm sure it makes you guys feel the same way. Anyways, um, I don't have much to go, like I said, I buy much. Then I went to Dose of Colors also, and there I bought um, two liquid lips. One of them is Los Angeles, which I'm not going to take out because it's what I'm wearing right now on my lips. It's one of the, her there newer shades. I don't think it's out yet. It's actually releasing on January 24th, and this is such a beautiful color. It's like a strawberry color. It's red, but with like a hint of pink. So I don't even say it's red, but it's like a pinkish red I don't know it's so beautiful though I I swatched it on my hand and I was like okay I'm taking it and then I'm also a sucker for like new releases sometimes like something will just come out and I don't even want it but just because I know it's out that day I'm like okay give it to me dude so bad so bad um the second lipstick I got was campfire this is also one of their new releases releasing on January 24th let me swatch this for you guys this is I don't know how I would describe this. It's kind of like an orangey, pinkish. I don't know. See it right here. It's the last one on the bottom here. It's really, really nice too, though. Um, I'll probably wear that tomorrow, actually. Um, but yeah, I, I really like that one too. So I only picked those two up because then I already have, own a few of their other colors. So yeah. And the other thing I got was their shell ideal duo loose pigment and primer um i haven't tried these but i've seen people post so much about them i was like you know what i'm gonna try them especially this color shell here um let me swatch the top for you this is i think the top one is like a tr primer it's like the cream base and then you go ahead and add the bottom which is like the loose uh shimmer or whatever or loose pigment it's right here i don't know if you guys can see it but top and bottom it's really really beautiful i feel like something really neutral that a lot of clients would like so i know i'll get good use out of that and then what was super cool about them was uh they give you a free gift which they didn't do last year so i was pretty excited about it and what it was was a full-size lipstick and lip gloss which i remember them selling around october because it was for breast cancer awareness and it was this beautiful pink creamy lipstick right here super pretty and then they also gave you this infinitely pink lip gloss. Like I said, both full size for breast cancer awareness. Super beautiful. And this one is called Cha Cha Pink. Okay. Then I went to Coco Lashes or to uh, Lady Moss Beauty because Coco Lashes are my favorites. And I bought a bunch of lashes there, especially Soho's. 
these are so good they're pretty much like queen bees but i feel like they're more comfortable because the band is thinner so that's what i'm wearing right now and i could wear these all day every day i swear i live by these but my number ones for sure queen bees that has not changed from last year actually last year i remember when i went to imax was the first time i bought them and i even mentioned it in my video that katie luster lux uses them and i didn't try them one year later forward my fucking babes bomb bomb seriously if you guys are looking for some bomb lashes these are it you can't go wrong with them they're super wispy and full and they just mm, so good so i got those queen bees and then i also got i think denim jeans they remind me of like the iconics but i don't know i like them a little bit more or if you've tried goddess by coco they're similar but i like these a little better i just feel like they're a little fuller i don't know they're really cute though okay. and then the last place i went was lady moss and there i just picked up two things picked up a loose glitter and copperella name says it all it's a coppery glitter and i'm not gonna swatch that it's super messy last thing i got was the silicone um makeup applicators let me open it i haven't even opened it um never tried them but they've been all over instagram so i was like dude i really want to try them and when i went i saw them there and they had like the clean ones so it's like, yeah. it's like nicole difficulties so yeah this is pretty much what it looks like I know you guys have seen them all over Instagram too. I have yet to try it. I'll probably try it tomorrow actually and I'll let you guys know. You guys don't follow me on Instagram or Snapchat. You should. My Snapchat is Heidi H-A-Y-D-E-E-X-O. And I'll probably write there how like I like it. But yeah, it's a little silicone applicator. Pretty much you just like dab your makeup on with it and it's supposed to waste a lot less product. So I can't wait to try that. I've been wanting to try it for a while now. So I can't wait. Okay, so yeah, like I said, um, I didn't buy too much actual makeup since I didn't want to buy my vanity also. But that's pretty much it for this video. I hope it inspired you girls to go out and buy makeup. Spend till you drop. No, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> no, I'm serious though. Um, that's all I have for now. Um, like It's a new year. I'm hoping to keep up with my channel more this time around. Keep posting more frequently throughout the year. So keep a lookout on that because it is something I want to do. Um, and yeah, like I said, that's all I have for now, so stay tuned for more videos, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!